This is a game that when you sign to a college that you dream of playing in. I mean, a big game, not just because it's for a conference title, but just because we're playing William Mary. I mean, it's the Battle of the Capital Cup. I mean, this is a game every year when you look at the schedule, you circle it. Just something about it when you realize how long that the cup has been going back and forth and how close the, um, the standings are. I think we're up like one or something like that, like 64 or 63 or something like that. But um, once you realize that, you just realize how, how far and how, um, yeah, how long ago the rivalry runs. It just adds to it. Obviously, everybody plays with a little bit more intensity on Saturday. 34 seconds, Judinsky takes the snap, fires over the middle of the field, Garcia has it. 40, 35, inside the 30. Snap back. Ball is down, kick is on the way, it has the distance, and it is good! I mean, this is something we've been talking about since we came on campus as freshmen. I mean, uh, in 2019, we had some great leaders, laid a foundation with Daniel Jones and guys like that. And I think ever since then, we've just been building on it. I mean, in the past, we've been close to winning big games. And it's like this year, we finally figured out a way to get over the hump. The guys we've been around have been the same guys we've been around for years now. Um, we just have a really good bond. Everybody gets along. Uh, we realize that it takes 11 of us to make a play. A battle of giants this week. I mean, like I said, we, we pride ourselves on being able to control the football and make plays. That credits the defense for getting on and off the field quickly. Uh, I mean, this week they want to run the football and it's going to be a physical game. So this week we got to strap our helmets up and we're going to have to play the physical blue collar game that we want to play every weekend. I think defensively it just comes down to getting off the field when it's time, you know, three downs and get them off the field. Uh, we know the percentage goes down for them getting first downs when they get to third down if it's third and long. So obviously we got to do good on first and second down, put them in third and long situations, uh, get them where we want them, and then get off the field. So the goal is always to get a ring, always to win a CAA championship. Um, yeah, I would have drew it up perfectly just like this. Maybe uh, take away some of the nail-biter games, but... <laughs> Obviously, that adds to the season, so um, I mean, it was good for us to overcome some adversity and uh, make us stronger through the, the close games, but yeah, I'll definitely draw it up just like this. It's going to be a physical, hard-nosed game. I mean, I've played this game two or three times now, and I mean, no matter the records or who's who, it's always going to be a game where you have to grind it out. It's never a game where you go in and it's smooth selling. Like, there's going to be momentum plays from both sides. Uh, we just have to... At the end of the day, it's going to be the team who can withstand the, the heavyweight punches that will be thrown on Saturday that will come out with the win.